whoever would make the wrong move at the wrong time would lose. Six hours a day, we work on clinch and Muay Thai. Of course, I don't want to. Silva. I want to try to take your head off. This is exactly what he wanted. He's got him down. I think he's amazing. And once he gets me to the ground, we're going to see if he's going to be able to finish me. The great competitor, very good at jiu-jitsu. I guess you'll be able to see out. And if I can take him there, then he's in trouble. I think this fight is going to win. Either I'm going to take his arm home with me or a choke. his life into one that will easily be forgotten. He's middleweight division. He is such a smooth character to it. When I talked to Ed Soros, his translator, the guy who owns Sinister, before the land, crap, making jokes, making a little fake absolute film on his face. It's not a nervous guy on the way to his camera. He's going to push his kids. 100% of his potential, which is a scary potential. The Octagon. Better than we've ever seen in the Octagon. His ground game is very good on the ground. He's a black belt. He's a black belt Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu by the new game. Do those still pale in comparison to Travis Luter? But there's a, there's a big difference between the average Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu yeah. black belt and it's He said, you know what, Mike? A lot of guys are professional basketball players. No. No, he's not. No, he's not that no, good? No, he's not that good. Oh, okay. no. I don't know any other basketball player. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's a very solid Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu black belt, world class. Steve with Anderson Silva. Oh, tail of the tape for South Dakota. Now fighting out of Fort Worth, Texas. The city for the official introductions of this our main event of the evening. It's time for the main event of introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, a Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu ball weighing in at 186 and one half pounds. Blue Jiu-Jitsu fighter who holds a professional record of 17 wins, fighting out of Curitiba, Brazil, the Raiders Silva is Herb Dean. Travis, protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions at all times. And I think, well, try not to read too much of the eyes of Travis Luter. Silva's going to try to... Will he avoid kicks early, Randy? For more of a wrestler's stance, he's got a little more weight on that front foot than a traditional kickboxing stance. To be feeling him out now, just kind of measuring him, trying to figure out the distance. Very impressive in his win in his UFC debut against Chris Lieben. Poor setup shot from the outside. Travis has got to at least engage in that middle. Negative of how weakened Travis is. I, I'm not sure if... It, or, you know, I can't imagine that his game plan is... I think he's surprised that... It, oh! Sluter's gonna work on top. Did you script that? I mean, that couldn't have been any. He took a big knee, got Pele down, passed his guard, mounted him, and took an arm. He likes to control guys by doing that. There he goes. But, but, but it's hard, and it's really hard to breathe, especially if you're in a weakened state. If that deed it is affected, Randy. That knee didn't miss by And him up here. He's got to take advantage of the situation. I mean, we've been seeing a lot of quick steps. So that's a nice job of kicking it away. Oh, that slow takedown. Anybody walk? Back out on range. Nice job by Travis Luter right there. I bet Travis Luter's fine. I just don't understand how, how he let that happen. He's a very smart guy. That show, too, as you well know, Randy. Oh, oh I'm oh, going for it. On legs. One thing about Travis, he takes a great shot. Yep. He's a tough guy. And have been by submission. 11 of his 17 victories have been by... He's countering very well. Ooh! 
This is where it gets exciting. His leg's gonna try and kick him away, and he passed right at that moment. And Anderson's got Luders right up. He's looking like he's going to, for a Kimura on that side. Now oh, he's mounted. Oh, he gets into the trouble. Silva. Luder looking to finish Silva. This is our attempt. Oh, Travis Luder's got to be killed. So much cleaner than that. Going to make him stand up here. OD's going to well, end of the round. Very, very interesting first round. That sloppy armbar. Let's take a look at that again. Anderson Silva here. He's landing some punches. Anderson stopping him with his hands. A little way like that is indicative of how weakened and uh, what a weakened state. Talks to take Travis Luter. Okay, He's all over Travis, the world right now. I mean, oh, let the, I mean, lose the opportunity to win this belt. Well, one thing about Luter, he is a calm guy. And he's the type of guy that can guard. Main event here at UFC Single Trunks. Nice up kick, kick. Try to He's got it in nice and deep. He does have it But that's, that's a locked in triangle. Between his shoulder and his neck. It allows him to breathe. As Keeps long the as he blood. going to pull down on the back of the head. Looking for more. He would get tapped here. Oh, that's so tight though. Nice up kick. Travis had to come back down into trying to move to Anderson Silva's right and pass to his left. He's going to tighten it again. But this is also, this is straining Anderson Silva. There's the tap. No, 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 Bang! Look okay to you, Joe. I mean, the point of the elbow coming down on the top of the head. Is that illegal? They came across. They came across. They were arcing across his yep. body. What the is wheels it? are is arcing there? parallel to the floor. I think they're okay. Why is that illegal? Straight up and down. It's pointed. It lands right on the top of the head. I really don't understand the difference. I'm world champion. Doesn't understand it. Contest at two minutes.